All right, welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to the Chupacabra Tutorials channel. I'm your host, Larry, and today I'm going to go over the optimal graphic settings for the game Avowed so you can get the best combination of good-looking graphics so you can take a look at all of the fancy glowing mushrooms around the game and also get the best performance so that you don't lag out while you're in the middle of combat casting all of these ginormous fancy spells. So to get started, all we have to do is go into our settings and then find our way to graphics, which is the first tab. So starting from top to bottom, you want to play in windowed full screen mode. Generally, full screen mode is the way to go for optimal performance in most games, although it is nice to be able to easily tab in and out to like play Netflix and stuff on your other monitor. You probably want to set a frame limit to unlimited unless you find that you're starting to have like stuttering or hitching, in which case I would turn it down to like 60 or 120 FPS. Your field of view is gonna be kind of a personal preference, but 90 is generally around where a lot of people like it. Third person field of view, generally same thing. Motion blur, I actually turn motion blur off just because eventually motion blur kind of gives me a little bit of a headache but you can go as far as like 50% if you like, because it's just fun to have that as an effect. V-Sync, I would turn that off. Ray Tracing, you can turn that off. It saves a lot of resources as well, but I'm going to leave that on because I just like the look of Ray Tracing. Uh, for upscaling for optimal performance, especially if you have a 1080p monitor, I would turn off. You can enable... NVIDIA DLSS if you have it, or AMD Fidelity FX, I have NVIDIA. For DLSS super resolution quality, this is sort of set up to prioritize if you want performance or if you want quality. If you have this at like a lower resolution because you have a 1080p monitor, I would set this at ultra performance. Otherwise, you could probably do balanced or quality. NVIDIA Reflex Low Latency. I will leave this at on if it's available. Uh, down here under graphics quality, I would leave this at custom. And here I would say for view distance, leave that on high just because it makes sure that things in the distance look really nice. Shadow quality, you can leave on high. Texture quality, high. Pretty much leave all of these on high. Although if you find that you're having a lot of lag for a, an older computer, you could turn down your shadow quality and then turn down the shading quality to medium or low would be a good marker for that. But for the most part, a lot of these call these settings are not going to affect you too, too much unless your computer is absolutely chugging, in which case you can even set your graphics quality to a medium or a low on the overall quality. And you'd have a pretty good time of playing it while it still looks pretty good. A lot of your performance is going to come back when you do things like disabling V-Sync, turning off ray tracing, and changing your upscaling settings to off. But it's going to kind of come down to, especially if you have an older system that's kind of struggling a little bit, playing around with these settings. And yeah, that'll be it for this one, ladies and gentlemen. This has been a brief look at how to optimize your graphics for Avowed for best performance. I've been your host, Larry. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and I'll catch you next time. Bye, everybody, and have a good one.